Well, hey there, everybody. I'm your host, Leo D. Cook, and welcome to Masterpieces of Children's Literature in Less Than a Minute. I'm just looking at this map of China because today's book takes place in China. Now, do you know where China's located? Yep, China is in Asia, and it's a pretty big place. Now, the book I will be talking about today is called Tiki Tiki Tembo by Arlene Mosell. Now, do you remember when I talked about Heidi and how you wouldn't forget her name? Well, hang tight, because this one's just like that one. This story takes place in ancient China, which was a long time ago. The two main characters are brothers, in which the younger one is named Chang, and the older one has the moniker, <sighs> Tiki Tiki Tembo No Sa Rembo Chari Bari Ruchi Pip Peri Pembo. Whew, that's a mouthful. Anywho, one day, the two brothers are playing by a well. This is never a good idea, and their parents told them not to do this, but Chang and Tiki Tiki Tembo No Sa Rembo Chari Bari Ruchi Pip Peri Pembo just don't listen. Unfortunately, Chang falls in the well and Tiki Tiki Tembo No Sa Rembo Chari Bari Ruchi Pip Peri Pembo runs to tell his mama about what happened to Chang. Now, as you can guess, their mama has a meltdown, but she tells you know who to go get somebody named the old man with the ladder, which is a pretty odd name considering Tiki Tiki Tembo No Sa Rembo Chari Bar Ruchi Pip Peri Pembo. Now, I wonder if this guy has a sister named Old Lady with a Step Ladder. Don't know. Back to the story. So the guy with the ladder rescues Chang for the well. Everything is cool for a while, but then the boys are playing by the well again, and Heidi, psh, whoops, I mean, Tiki Tiki Tembo No Sa Rembo Chari Bar Ruchi Pip Peri Pembo falls in. If you want to know what happened to What's His Face, I suggest you read Tiki Tiki Tembo by Arlene Mosel. You'll be glad you did. My name's Leo D. Cook, and I'm just grateful that my name isn't Tiki Tiki Tembo No Sa Rembo Chari Bar Ruchi Pip Peri Pembo. And I'll see you next time on Masterpieces of Children's Literature in less than a minute.